You take the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe. You take the red pill. You stay in Wonderland. And I show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. This one. You want this one? No! No! Why would you take a pill from someone wearing sunglasses that you just met? What is wrong with you? Go get some milk. What's going on, everybody? It is Tuesday, November 17th, 2020. This is War Cub Zero Hour Inspiration Edition. But before we get to that, let me tell you something. Big news coming out of Craven County Schools. Big news. Guess what? Elementary kids going back to school four days a week. Oh, what? Yes, you heard it. Four days a week. No news on middle school yet as we continue to try to follow uh, proper guidelines and keep everybody safe. But it's cool. I mean, things are, things are happening, right? That's awesome. Hopefully, we'll hear some things in the future. Uh, sports coming back. Basketball signups. It's happening. Tryouts the week after Thanksgiving. Uh, but you do need to look at your email, sign up on that Google form if you're interested in trying out because we need to know that you're coming and we have to make sure that all your paperwork is filled out so you can just not dropped off and left there. Now, let's talk about inspiration. Let's talk about COVID a little bit, right? This time has been tough socially, right? We're not getting to hang out with as many people as our friends and all that good stuff. Um, but just kind of thinking back in my life, like I got a lot of good friends right now, but what about, you know, previous Jordan, like it, it, past Jordan, what about the years? If I could go back during high school and middle school, what what were the people I was hanging out with? They weren't the best, okay? They were not the best. And I gotta think about that. Fr our friends influence us a lot. And they affect our moods, our emotional state, everything, right? So we wanna make sure that we surround ourselves with some solid friends. Today's quote comes from Arnold uh, Glasgow, Gow, Glasgow. Mm -hmm. He was an American businessman. Uh, he's no longer uh, alive uh, as he has passed away. But he said, "A true friend never gets in your way unless you happen to be going down." So a true friend never gets in your way unless you happen to be going down. What he's saying is, hey, if you are doing great things, if you're on your way to success, your friend is going to be cheering you on. Your friend is not going to be trying to get in your way, sabotage you so they can look good or anything like that, they're gonna be happy for you. But if you are on this straight decline, look going toward the you know rock bottom, you know a true friend's gonna jump in the way. They're not gonna sit to the side of that and see their friend uh, do that to themselves. They're gonna jump in the way and help you out. And I think that's really important, especially in this time for us to realize who our friends are, who's a true friend, who's a great friend. And that's really gonna help us where we are emotionally, um, and mentally, y'all, I'm telling you, if you got some great friends, you know it, and you shout it from the rooftops, but if you don't, time to sever some ties, that's all I'm saying. Rough cut. So what I'm saying to y'all is we need to take a look at our lives, see who we're surrounding ourselves with, that, because that influences us greatly. And we need to make sure that we got some good people around us, some good friends, some true friends, that's not gonna get in our way when we're doing great things, but they're gonna step in and stop us when we're doing stupid crap and we're messing up and we're going downhill and that friend just comes along and says, hey, Mr. Osbrook, that's not smart. You don't need to be doing that. That's what we need. That's the milk that we need and we need to go out there and get that milk. Get it.